On May 22, 1957, one of the worst accidents imaginable occurred just outside of Albuquerque. An H-bomb accidentally fell out of a B-36 bomber jet as it descended to land at Kirtland Air Force Base. Not fully armed, the bomb left a crater about 25 feet in diameter and 12 feet deep. This photograph explores that incident. First things first, let's focus on the photograph within the photograph. Staging the scene in the field as opposed to the studio, Nagatani digs a hole to replicate the original impact crater made by the 42,000 pound Mark 17 bomb. He then pours in green and yellow paint to highlight the site. Two foam board cutouts of women in military uniforms stand guard at either side, and nearby a nude model poses provocatively for a photographer, like one of Edward Weston's nudes in the California desert. Off to the left, a Pueblo Indian family, again a foam board cutout, poses for yet another photographer. In the foreground, three mock reporters confront us with their gazes as they document the accident. There's one last thing. A model of the B-36 bomber that dropped the bomb hangs from a metal scaffolding just outside of the frame. The wind was so strong that the plane couldn't stay still. Instead, it is captured in motion, its blurred image suggesting a flyby. In the end, this elaborate staging didn't create the effect Nagatani wanted. He decides to revisit the site and try again. Equipped with a print of the first attempt, he locates the crater he created, now covered in snow. Dressed in army gear and black gloves, Nagatani stands facing Kirtland Air Force Base and the Sandia Mountains in Albuquerque. He holds the first photograph, his view camera casting a shadow on his back. He finishes the piece by printing the sky a violet hue. Here, Nagatani presents a photograph within a photograph, and other photographs and photographers within those photographs. In so doing, he draws our attention to the complicated relationship between actual historical events and layered representations through which we come to know about those events.